Hey there, what's up guys? Coming at you with a quick workbench update here. Hope you're all doing well actually. It's uh, a little chilly. It's Thursday evening here. Hope everyone's doing well. Hope you're all doing great. So I'm working on the uh, 85 Oldsmobile 442. This thing's coming along real nice. This is a real nice kit here. So got the body in a silver right now because I'm going to have the silver rocker panels on it. And the silver goes all the way around the front underneath there. So got the silver. It's looking really good. I'm going to mask that off. going to do it. Um, original plan was a metallic blue, but I think I'm going to do a metallic green. I'll show you why in a second here. So this body is real nice. It's got nice crisp lines. Engine bay is kind of cool. It's got all the uh, all your doodads in there. Got to paint all that up. Nicely detailed. I kind of like though when they're separate because then you can do it separately and then put it in rather than try to pick them out. I think it's a little easier all separate. But anyways, that, that's nice and detailed. The interior is coming along real nice here. Got the two-tone uh, gray and a kind of a uh, army green thing going on here. That's why I want to change the uh, the color of the uh, the car. Because I think the car should be a greenish color. So the seats are coming along real well. Put the dashboard in. Dashboard obviously needs a little work yet. So that's going to look real sharp. I, I like that a lot. Got to do some touch-ups on the, uh, the grays there and whatnot. But that's going to be real sweet. Got a couple parts here that still need to be painted. Like the steering wheel here needs some help. Off my black sweater, it's hard to see. Underneath the car here, real nice chassis. Like I said, goes together great. Need some touch-ups on uh, the black, especially around uh, the silver here where I painted. And then the, um, need some touch-ups around the exhaust there. I had a little hard time getting that in there. Engine, again, falls together beautifully. Now, I did the engine... Uh, uh, gold. It says to do it black. I did mine gold. Kind of reminiscent of the uh, the 68 442s. So kind of a little tribute thing going on there. I always paint my fans yellow. I don't know why. I just do. So that's kind of cool. Goes together real nice. Can't wait to get the air cleaner on there. All the the hoses all on there. It, this is going to be real nice. So still got to do well the rear shocks. Paint the wheels. I'm going to go with the uh, the classic cutlass wheels there. I'm not going to use any of the striping on the decal sheets. Just going to, um, like I said, just mask off the uh, the rocker panels and do it, uh, do it black. Or uh, silver rocker panels. So I think with the, uh, using the, uh, the FE3 hood, looks kind of cool. Kind of reminiscent of my Monte Carlo. 75 Monte Carlo so I like that so it's not much to show but I wanted to catch you guys up where I was um, so I'm gonna get back to doing some uh, body work here on the car get that ready to go uh, hopefully could have a coat of paint on that tomorrow actually got to see what kind of paints I have sitting here hope I have a green got one in mind that I'm thinking of but um, excuse me so I'll catch you guys in a little bit. You guys have a good night. Be safe.